Welcome to the weekly market update from Signature Wealth Management. I'm Brian Ransom, Research Director for Signature Wealth, and here's what happened in the market this week. The market continues to march higher this week, up over 2% since close on Friday. This follows five days of moving sideways last week. Currently, the state of the economy is still in recovery mode. The acceleration of that recovery has been rapid and should continue to do so on a year-over-year basis. But there remains a long road ahead to reach the pre-COVID trendline growth rate of real GDP. The speed of the recovery is dependent upon the vaccine rollout. Currently, the United States has vaccinated 17.2 million people with at least one dose. Per 100 people, Alaska, West Virginia, and the Dakotas are outpacing the rest of the states, and the country as a whole has administered 5.2 doses per 100 people. Currently, the U.S. trails four countries in doses per capita, but still outpaces much of the rest of the world. While the vaccine rollout has been far from perfect, the efficiency of that rollout has been accelerating over the last month reaching an average of over 900,000 doses administered per day. There is more help on the way. Johnson & Johnson is expected to publish their vaccination study results, which could help rapidly bolster the vaccine supply within the month. Logistically, the Johnson & Johnson vaccine should be a big boost to the vaccination efforts because the vaccine can be stored at refrigeration temperatures and only requires one dose. Finally, we are seeing a drop in daily COVID-19 cases over the last two weeks, as well as hospitalizations and daily deaths. This implies both the vaccinations and recent containment procedures are working. We may very well have seen the final peak of COVID-19. For more information on this topic or a variety of other topics, including market updates, financial planning, and wealth management, please visit our blog at signaturewmg.com slash blog. That's signaturewmg.com slash blog.